Okay, so I finally got the electronics for the Nixie tube clock working this weekend. Uh, it was surprisingly easy with the detailed instructions provided by Pete. Um, so it's all working, tickety boo. You can see when we get to the 10 second mark, instead of just going from 9 to 0, it actually winds back and ripples down. Another cool thing, uh, when we get to the 50 second mark, the time, we've got hours, minutes and seconds, scrolls off and now we get the date, uh, month, day, year. And then the other really cool thing, when we roll around on a 10 minute mark, well 10 minutes, 10 seconds, every 10, 10 minutes, 10 seconds, uh, we do the, uh, it, well it's like a slot machine type display and it's really cool, it just looks cool. It's actually uh, getting rid of any cathode poisoning which I'd never heard of before but I just think the effect's really cool you know, I'd be quite happy if it did that all the time to be honest so there we are looking very very cool and very tasty indeed now the next stage is to make the uh, the Victorian steampunk cabinet for it uh, with all the other little bits and pieces that are going to go along with it I cannot wait